This is an ABC 7 Storm Track Weather First Alert. Oh, well, a happy Sunday to you all. Today, it was a very windy start to the day as that first cold front pushed through. You called that ABC 7 First Alert to warn you about those winds. We definitely did feel those winds early on in the day. We're looking at our temperature trend for the past 24 hours, so you can compare yesterday to today's temperatures and see exactly when that cold front pushed through. So yesterday around this time, we were in the 90s, so well above average. On average, we should be in the mid to lower 80s. And then, of course, our temperatures dipped down overnight. And then it looks as if our temperatures really didn't get much warmer. We sat in the 60s by 11 o'clock, and then we reached 70s by 2 o'clock, and right now we are at 76. So we had above average temperatures yesterday, and for today, below average temperatures as a result of that cold front. Wind speeds, we've dealt with gusts of up to 40 miles per hour in some parts of town. Right now, 21 miles per hour for El Paso with 13 in Las Cruces. 24 for Sierra Blanca and 31 miles per hour Guadalupe Pass. So still dealing with some breezy conditions in parts of town. Tonight we'll continue to deal with those breezy low and windy conditions with 53. The expected overnight low and mostly clear skies. Calmer night for Las Cruces, but temperatures will be a bit chilly. 44 is the expected overnight low tonight. Now for tomorrow, those temperatures will be right where they should be around this time of the year. We're looking at 82, the expected high with Windy conditions still in the forecast. Gusts of up to 35 miles per hour, so that does put us in the windy category. Mostly sunny for Las Cruces, and temperatures will be in the 80s for tomorrow. But it's later Tuesday when we are looking at that cold front that's going to push through, bring winds with it, very strong winds. On top of that, slightly cooler temperatures as well. Windcast shows gusts of up to 50 miles per hour expected. When? Well, from 3 to your 7 o'clock hour. Winds are coming from the west southwest, so east northeast side of town. You're going to feel those strongest wind gusts. And if you have any outdoor decorations, I can't stress it enough, tie them down or just bring them indoors because 50 miles per hour can do damage to anything that's outdoors. The threats we're looking at for your Tuesday. Strong winds in the high category. Blowing dust and sand could be an issue if these winds are really strong, especially in areas that have a lot of blowing dust and loose sand. So that's in the medium category. Then cooler temperatures in the low category because it is going to be cooler, but nothing we can't really handle around this time of the year. Seven day forecast shows 80s for two, Monday and Tuesday. Then Tuesday afternoon into the evening, that's when that cold front rolls through. It's going to dip down our temperatures to the lower 50s overnight, Tuesday into Wednesday. And then it's going to keep us at the 70s for Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. I mean, can't complain. We'll take those 70 degree temperatures. Then for the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, we're looking at mostly sunny skies with temperatures in the upper 70s, 77 for Saturday and 78, the expected high for your Sunday of next weekend. We have a look at sports after the break. Stick around.